have I done an intro for this vlog? I think not. And I'm way deep into the vlog. So <laughs> I'll have to do an intro real quick. Hi guys, welcome, welcome to my channel, welcome to yet another vlog. If you're new here, my name is Emily. If you are a returning subscriber, you friend, I'm my favorite person, and you don't even know it yet. So yes, I'm deep into this vlog and I realized I've not done an intro. So I'm sorry for that, but welcome to this week's vlog. Good morning, it's time for breakfast. I didn't have dinner last night, I had an early lunch instead. So I'm having butternut soup, cake, plantain, wings from yesterday, sausages, a hot cup of coffee, water, and I also received some flowers. So that is breakfast right there. Sorry for the background noise. For lunch, I'm having good old rice and steel minji and a glass of a lot some some and that is lunch for today i'm having lunch as i watch formula one which is the plan for today's afternoon good morning guys today is monday another day another court day I have caught it's virtual so I'm waiting for the link to open up and then we can begin so I'll catch you guys right after I'm done with court guys I finished up with court around 12 it's now to what 246 and I just ordered myself a cake I didn't want the people at Black Forest to judge me for ordering myself 1 kg of cake so what i did was i lied to them to write happy birthday Emily. my birthday is all the way in december but how nobody's gonna know how they gonna know nobody's gonna know nobody's gonna know it's not my birthday it's very very cold i'm on my second cup of cappuccino as i watch something on tv i've just realized i also have caught next week on uh, wednesday sorry i had to pick up a call i was saying i've just been served with a mentioned date and i have another matter on the same date in different courts and they are all virtual so in layman language what that means is like i've been double booked it can be hectic at times but i'm going to figure a way out for sure because yo it's hectic but i'll find a way to maneuver that so i also don't know what i'm going to have for dinner all my meat is frozen it's too late to start defrosting now but i think i'll just have cake and coffee and those are the packs of living alone you can try this out especially if you are married i guess anyway so yeah that's that that's uh the current situation as we speak so I'm just going to wait for my cake and as soon as it's here, mm, for sure satisfy my cravings. So apparently I have to wait till five for my cake to be delivered and I am not about that. I ordered KFC, two pizza, sticky, to Shikilia Tumbo before the cake comes here and which is what I'm going to have now and wait till 5 p.m. The birthday cake is here. Let me show you guys. Nobody's gonna know. Nobody's gonna know. How will they know? Good morning. I woke up, had breakfast. I had cake and coffee. Cake from yesterday. And now I'm catching up on my favorite, favorite Ratchet TV. It's uh, Love and Hip Hop Atlanta season 10. 
episode one which is what i'm going to watch as i respond to emails on my phone so guys i'm still here in my couch the only notable thing that i did was uh let me show you the only notable thing i did was change water for those white roses there and i'm still watching focus and i'm still watching ratchet tv i ordered lunch from a neighboring restaurant and that's my glass of mojito that's what i'm going to have for lunch so for dinner i have some minced meat left i'm going to defrost that and have tortillas for dinner so i'll catch you guys as i make dinner good morning guys it's definitely the following day i woke up uh, around 7 30 and i want to go and make breakfast i didn't uh manage to make the tacos yesterday so i think i'm going to make them today also i need to go and do grocery shopping today because i don't even have kitchen tissues so i'm going to make breakfast which is basically cake and yogurt and then answer maybe one or two emails that i saw came in last night and then head out to do my grocery shopping i also need to book a nail appointment because what is this what is this uh, for tomorrow it lacks probably in the morning if i can get the 7 a.m slot I'll be so so lucky so yeah that's all there is to today let me prepare breakfast real quick and that is breakfast for today cake and yogurt Guys, forget the girl you saw in the morning with her robe. This one right here is the real deal. I am headed to go do my grocery shopping now. It's what time? It's 12.02. Should be back by 2 or 3. And yeah, that's just about it. My scent of the day is black opium. It's going to be black opium actually because I haven't put it on yet. Mm -hmm. Right, that's enough and yes i'm dressed up and dolled up to go and buy groceries because i'm not letting go any moment to dress up so let me submit the outfit of the day today i did my makeup perfectly doesn't look like the other day and this nude lippy is the one that i got from original makeup their page is on instagram it's in the shade la lady if i'm not wrong and look at that beauty beauty in a lipstick here are the repercussions of eating one kg of cake anyway for the outfit of the day so i'm wearing this scarf and a bodysuit <laughs> yo if you see it it's my gift from me to you because it's a beautiful gift jeans are high-waisted they are from chica my shoes right there were a birthday gift but i know you can get them at uh, forever trendy my sweater and my bodysuit which looks like that are from kairetu's apparel i'll leave their link somewhere down here she doesn't sell such type of clothes but she can personally shop for you if you want her to do so and that is my bag for the day and yeah let me head out i'll see you guys when i'm back I am done with grocery shopping 
if i do a haul for these that will be another video so what i'm going to do i'm going to show you guys the things that i am excited to try out or the ones that i would recommend or the ones that i'd like to put you on so at the discount section i got this cute mug for 120 shillings i also got this for 400 shillings i am a collector of clear mugs and i liked this one because it's huge i also got this measuring clear jug at uh at around 200 shillings i also got this for i don't know the price these i saw chris jenner drinking with and if you don't know who chris jenner is you're too young so i got it water is for vibes and i'm curious to try this out i also got this reed diffuser for i think 890 shillings i had uh i, I smelled it just to be sure of the scent and i love the scent i think i'm going to put it in my living room and try it out i also got this fridge organizer for i think 400 bob and i don't think this will go to my fridge because there is no white thing going inside my fridge probably a clear one not a white one i'll find something to organize in it i also got this corkscrew for i think 400 shillings this stuff was at the discount section those three okay and then i also got these at an offer these two pans were going for 950 shillings together with that moiko it's a set as is and i want to try out this pan especially i'm going to make dinner with it today and then the other thing that i got was unrefined sugar this is said to be healthier than uh, the refined one so i want to try it out as well and i also got this astonish grease remover which purports to be stronger than the normal lemony one so i'm curious to try it out as well other than that everything else is just normal grocery shopping so i'll see you guys as i make dinner i have changed into more cooking appropriate clothes and best believe i am going to use the new pots to make dinner which is tacos so the minced beef goes here and the tacos will go here so let me cook i am starving i haven't had anything the whole day other than the cake and yogurt that i had in the morning and dinner is ready those are the tacos fries and a glass of cold mojito let me enjoy my food and i'll catch you guys tomorrow good morning guys it's definitely the following day i was lucky enough to get the 7 a.m slot at lux so i'm going to get my nails done i've done a subtle face beat I didn't do my eyebrows because I want to go and get them done as well. So, you know, I'm here to submit the outfit of the day. I'm wearing this Louis scarf. Uh, jacket is from Chica and jeans are from Queen's Classy Collections. You can find them on Instagram. My shoes, as always, are from Forever Trendy. T-shirt is thrifted and that is my bag right there. And for the scent of the day, I'm wearing Langtada by Givenchy. So yeah, that is uh, all there is.
So guys, I came back home about one hour ago, but I had to do some work that came up when I was in town. I got my nails done and my eyebrows too. So from town, what I got was this rope basket. I'm currently in talks with my carpenter because I've changed my mind. I don't want an old glass, an old glass console. I think I'm going to get glass plus wooden, but black in color. I am currently in talks with my with my carpenter to do that for me. He's just uh, waiting for me to tell him to come and do the measurements. So I got this rope basket. It's quite big at a smart lady home. That's how it looks like. I want to be storing my throw on blankets here and just place it next to the console table once it comes and then I passed by home deco the rope basket you can get at um smart lady home they are on instagram this is pampas grass for my small vase that will be at the top of the console table as well and i hope i don't ruin this so i got how many of these i got one two three four five six seven eight of these these are mini pampas grass and i'll put them on that verse and style it on top of my console table the other thing that i got was what is this oh i got a turtleneck a black turtleneck at chica's place and it's cute it has a button detail there at the top i don't like one that extends all the way to here so this one will fit me perfectly so that's how it looks like what else did i get <laughs> and chica bought me lunch this is chips chicken and a soda <laughs> because you guys really show up when you go to shop at chica's and if you use my name you better use my name if you go to, to chica's shop please use my name You'll always get a discount so lunch from chica as usual <laughs> the other thing that i got was my was my monthly meat supply which is that and i usually get this at a, a shop called danny Kam. it's a very reputable place to buy meat at city market so yeah that's that that is all i got from town and i am tired I actually want to take a quick nap, maybe two hours, and then I'll dig in into that lunch from Chica. That's what I'll probably have for dinner. And then I'll catch you guys as I'm having dinner. So see you then. Let me go and take a nap. I am tired. Guys, I just woke up from my nap and warmed dinner. It is freezing, freezing cold. Yo, uh, uh. So that is how I styled my rope basket. The console will be there in between the plant and these. And because it's freezing cold, I'm picking this one to cover myself. So I'm going to dig in as I watch Dogs Season 2. It's one of my favorite series because I am a lover of animals. So I'm going to catch up on Season 2 and then sleep and i'll catch you guys tomorrow good morning guys is it my morning no it's afternoon good afternoon guys i woke up early i woke up at around nine and then i had to jump on to work and it's now 12. so this is when i'm making breakfast for breakfast i'm having plantain and veggie samosas these are the samosas that i prefer they are the vegetable samosas from south south i hope i'm pronouncing that correctly this is my cup of tea so i added in an extra tea bag and i'm going to warm it up and I actually noticed from my Kafo mini haul that I might not have shown you guys that uh, the video might not have been very clear. So this is the measuring jug that I got and this mug as well as this mug. And in true Emily fashion, 
I've already broken it, but I'll replace it the next time I go to Carrefour. This was the reed diffuser that I got. It's called Senso Home in the Saint Magic Garden and this stuff is legit. My house smells amazing. I can tell you that for sure. And I think I got it for less than a thousand shillings in case I didn't mention that. Probably 900 shillings if I'm not wrong. So let me make breakfast. I am starving. These are really nice. Which brand is this? Festive sub rolls. Okay. Because they are pre cut for you. I like that. I like that about this. I think I'll be getting this going forward. There they are. and breakfast but more of lunch actually brunch is ready this is what i'm going to have as i watch the real housewives of beverly hills i am done for the week and today is friday so the weekend is finally here i can catch up on uh, all the stuff that i haven't watched for this week so yeah that is that <laughs> So guys, I do not enjoy drumsticks. So usually when I have to make them, I have to put in the work, like a lot of work so that I can enjoy them. So I made a sticky and sour drumsticks with fries and a veggie salad. That is the only wine glass left to my name. I broke the other one yesterday as well. And that is dinner for today. I have posted the recipe for these on my Instagram. Check out the highlight. It's captioned sticky and sour drumsticks or drumsticks could be either. And my, I'm going to leave my Instagram handle somewhere here so that you can check out this recipe if you're interested in making sweet and sour drumsticks. So that is dinner for today and I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Good morning guys, I just woke up, I want to take a hot long shower but I want to wash my boiler so that I can have it as hot as I'd want to. Okay, so I have no intention of being productive today. I just want to be a coach potato. But first I'm going to take a shower and then I'll make breakfast after that. So that's all there is to today. And I shamedly binge on my favorite TV shows till evening. And that is what I'm going to have for breakfast. A cup of cappuccino in this uh, mug that I got at Cafo and vegetable cocktail samosas plantain and uh, a hot dog a very basic hot dog if I may say so and that is breakfast for now let me go binge watch on my favorite TV shows so guys it's currently at 640 I have been binge watching married to medicine I am on episode 11 six more episodes to go and i'll make sure i watch them before midnight the only thing i've been doing so far is alternating between white coffee water and apple juice i guess you can call this my evening snack and i want to make sure that i finish season three before i go to bed so yeah that's all i've been doing and if i don't talk to you guys again i'll see you tomorrow Good morning guys. Today I did my makeup like a pro. And it anyway, I'm heading out. I'm going to hang out with a friend and then I'll be back in the evening. So I want to submit the outfit of the day. It's definitely the following day. I slept late last night, but I finished season three of what I was watching. And I'll carry on with the other episodes as 
soon as I get free time to do that. So for the outfit of the day, I am wearing a turtleneck, the one that I got from Chica. My high-waisted jeans are from Chica as well. This trench coat is from uh, a mama that sells trench coat just next to where I live and I'm wearing and I'm wearing these thigh high boots that I got from InStyle Shoes KE. They are on Instagram. My trench coat is a bit small but I haven't yet come into terms with that. Although I need to so that I can hand it down to one of my sisters. For the scent of the day, I am wearing this is the wine that I'm taking with me to my friend's place. For the scent of the day, I'm wearing Jojo by Dior, darling. And that's the full fit of the day. For the bag, I'm going to be carrying that one over there, the brown one at the bottom, Kabisa. And I can't bring you guys along with me because my friends are a bit low-key, unlike me. So I wouldn't want to make them feel uncomfortable with my camera recording and everything. So with that, I think I can end this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to my vlog and I'll catch you on the next one. Bye!